Our next round is called This Is My, where we bring on a mystery guest who has a close connection to one of our panellists. This week, each of Lee's team will claim it's them that has the genuine connection to the guest. And it's up to David's team to spot who's telling the truth. So please welcome this week's special guest, Steve. <laughs> Welcome, Steve. So, Hugh, first of all, what is Steve to you? This is my friend Steve, who rescued me when I got stuck in a cave looking for bats. Uh, Rufus? Uh, this is my friend Steve, and together we have visited every pub inside the M25 called the Red Lion, apart from four of them. <laughs> And, uh, Lee, how do you know Steve? This is Steve, and uh, we once went camping together when we were in the Scouts, and we woke up to find that someone had stolen our tent. <laughs> David's team, <laughs> where to begin? Uh, so when was this uh, camping trip, Lee? Uh, this camping trip was, uh, oh, I would have been about 13, 12, I think, 12. Something how like. old was Steve? Steve was about, uh, I don't know. <laughs> 13. He, was, he wasn't born. <laughs> That's what made the whole thing awkward. <laughs> no, he was, uh, he was about, about seven, seven or eight. So you were 12 or 13. <laughs> you were... He wasn't in the Scouts. He was just a seven-year-old you'd brought along. <laughs> He was, the Cubs and the Scouts went together. He was in the Cubs, I was in the Scouts, and they, and asked, they oh, issued no every Scout with, with a cup. They did, actually. <laughs> no way. No way. <laughs> they, they, they put each, each uh, young boy in with an older boy in each tent. Uh, so, where, where were you camping? Uh, we were camping uh, somewhere in uh, the Lake District. I think it was called uh, the Lake District. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you woke up with no tent, is that what you said? Correct. Went to sleep with a tent, woke up without a tent. Do you know... What happened to said tent? It, uh, well, that's a good question. We don't know to this day what happened to said tent. You, you never, said it, you you never said saw was, the tent you said again. It was no, no, no. Stolen? We, yes, I know it was stolen. Oh, we don't know, stolen. Don't know what happened to it. You don't think it might have blown away? You, sorry, you woke up, no tent, and you assumed foul play. <laughs> <laughs> we weren't that deep a sleeper that there was a gale force figure. <gasps> oh, you, you were deep enough that someone had stolen yeah. the tent. There's something about wind that's different to, to burglars. They don't, wind doesn't. Wind! <laughs> wind! <laughs> That's different to burglars. There I agree with you. Wind. Now, if that was what you were asserting, that and that alone, I would say you were telling the truth. Wind. However, that's not a this story. Wind does not sneak up on you. Can I ask a question? <laughs> did this tent not have a built-in ground sheet? No, it did not. Because otherwise, it would have been, this is Steve and we were once kidnapped. <laughs> I'm going to jump in here. David, please move on to somebody else. <laughs> All right. Um, Steve, would you please reveal your true identity? Well, I'm Steve. I'm Rufus's best friend. <laughs> And together, we visited all of the pubs called the Red Lion inside of the M25, apart from four. 